What is up, Swarm? Corey here with Honeyland, and uh, I have the announcement that you have been waiting for for weeks, months, years, probably not years since you didn't know about us years ago, but the official Mint announcement is here. I've got the date, I've got the time, I've got the details, and mark this down in your calendars. The Mint date is officially public Mint on May 26th. It will be sometime in the morning Pacific Standard Time, I think around about 10 a.m. So uh, we'll have the official time and all that stuff announced um, in our Discord, in all of our channels. We'll have it on our website. Uh, but I wanna give you like the, just mark the dates down in the calendar. May 26th is going to be the public mint. The pre-sale will take place on May 25th, so 24 hours before the public mint, you will have the pre-sale. So if you're holding on to one of those platinum passes or those gold passes, if you have a whitelist A token, those will be able to be minted at 24 hours before the public mint on May 25th. By the way, it happens to be my anniversary. Uh, so that's how I'll be spending my wedding anniversary, minting in the community, chatting with you guys, watching all the excitement. I will be available to, through voice chat that entire day. Uh, making sure that we're connecting, answering questions, and then heading into the following day, uh, May 26th, you will have the public mint sometime in the morning, and about two and a half hours before that is when we will start our community mint, which is anybody who's holding on to a whitelist B token. So if you've got a whitelist token from purchasing apparel in our store, if you've got one of those, um, a whitelist token through um, honeypots or, or any sort of a whitelist as a community that you've, uh, or a collaboration, you've come over from another community, those are gonna be the whitelist B tokens. A whitelist B token will allow Allow you to mint about two and a half hours before the public mint and then of course if you don't have any whitelist tokens what the heck are you doing uh go plug into us get into our community we've got uh, a number of whitelist spots that we can still give out we have a number of actually gold passes and platinum passes that we are going to be handing out to our community uh just a couple days before those mints take place to the people who are really giving us giving our community the most whether it's through contributing and um, impacting the community engaging in the community um, showing up on our spaces and our amas and our voice chats and sharing what we're doing with friends and liking and commenting and retweeting and um, all of those things are getting noticed i promise you you. Of course, you can come in, you can play in the games that we're doing in our Discord and our community. Uh, we've got a number of other contests and things, kind of a point system that we're going to be launching um, later this week. Um, and so we have a ton, or within the next week, I should say, we've got a ton of really, really cool things that we're doing. Um, we want to get Whitelist into the hands of the people who we want to be a part of the swarm, that we want to be a part of that Genesis community. I promise you guys, this is going to be a special, special mint. So what's the price? The price is going to be 2.5 soul. Um, Regardless of how much soul is worth at the time, I don't care if it tanks all the way to 20 or if it skyrockets all the way to 200, we are minting at 2.5 soul. We're hoping it will land somewhere around that $100 mark uh, in terms of what soul is worth. That's kind of what we are planning. But regardless of where it is, 2.5 soul is the price. Get that into your wallets. Make sure that you have that before the mint date for however many Genesis Bs you intend to or you plan to mint. Let me give you some details just kind of about the mint and what you're actually getting. And so what you're gonna be minting, we have 11,000 total supply of Genesis eggs that we will mint throughout the entire history of Honeyland. So that's the, 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 the maximum number that we will ever mint. We know that we are gonna be minting 5,500 in this first go around, this Genesis mint that takes place on May 25th for the, for the uh, pre-sale, and then May 26th for the community sale and the public sale, we will have a total of 5,500 Genesis eggs that we will mint. Of those, 500 will be queen bees and 5,000 will be regular bees. So what do you get with a Genesis egg? Those Genesis eggs will eventually be able to take, uh, be taken to our hatching machine, which will be kind of the, the actual mint reveal. So you'll be minting an actual egg for now that you'll hang on to. And then we will have a hatching machine that you'll be able to basically take that egg NFT, put it into our hatching machine, and we'll have the actual reveal of your Genesis B or queen B, depending on which egg you have. You will know if you have a queen or if you have a regular egg, as soon as you mint your egg uh, on May 25th or May 26th, you will not know the rarity or the traits of that queen or regular B until you actually put it in our hatching machine. Now here's the really cool thing. When you uh, decide that you want to hatch your egg into a bee, uh, you can put it in any of the actual of the hatching machines that are available for any universes in Honeyland that are currently open. Each universe has its own species, it has its own landform, it has its own aesthetics, its own art style, its own lore. And so if you wanna get that bee into the game as quickly as possible so that you can start using it to earn and collect and breed and all those things, you'll probably hatch it in universe one as soon as you can, as soon as it's available, which will be even prior to the game launch. Um, 
Um, if you're somebody who maybe wants to hold on to that more for the, the NFT value, the, the value of what it could be, and you want to mint that in future universes so you can have uh, pro what will most likely be more rare species. I assume that, um, uh, you know, I have no idea, but I think probably at least half of the people holding on to Genesis eggs will uh, hatch them in our universe one before the game. And you'll have a couple thousand that will be sitting out there that, um, you know, you, you, you just won't, they'll be waiting for future universes uh, because they want to get that rarity and, and uh, they're willing to sacrifice the ability to play and earn uh, and own other assets inside of Honeyland with that Genesis B um, because they want to hang on to the egg and, and have the future um, kind of control of where it goes. So uh, what else do you get with the Genesis egg? So uh, inside of Honeyland, Genesis Bs will have no breeding limits. Uh, so they have unlimited breeding. Uh, they will have the highest breeding multiplier of any bees, meaning their offspring will typically be the strongest bees. They will be um, able to breed uh, generation two bees, so that the highest generation, the highest traits of any sort of breeding that will take place in the game. Um, and they, um, let's see, uh, no breeding limits. Oh, and they have themselves the highest traits as well. So they will have, uh, they will be really, really valuable inside of Honeyland. But if you've been following this project, you know that this Genesis collection will be very, very special even outside of Honeyland. So what are we doing for this Genesis Mint outside of Honeyland? Three things that we can announce today, okay? Number one, paper hands bitch insurance, or as my mom likes me to call it, the first ever risk-free mint on Solana. So what does that mean? On May 25th or May 26th, you guys will pay us 2.5 soul to mint your Genesis egg. For 41 days after the public mint, if you don't feel like that you've gotten your value out of that Genesis egg, that you would rather have your 2.5 soul back than have your Genesis egg, we're gonna let you do that. All you'll need to do is list it on any one of the major marketplaces. So looking at Magic Eden or Fractal, we will be sweeping the floor every 12 hours on there. And anything that is at 2.5 solar below, we will personally be buying and we will be burning those forever, which means 100% risk-free mint. If you're not sure if you wanna hang on to that thing, you don't know what the value is gonna be long-term, you're really more focused on what's what's the value of that actual floor today. Um, by the way, I, I, I don't expect with what we have in the pipeline, what we're going to be announcing and delivering throughout that first 41 days, heck, throughout that first 41 minutes after the mint, uh, you guys will absolutely, uh, I don't expect for that floor ever to touch anything near 2.5. I think this will be one of the best investments that you can make all year. Uh, I think I'm supposed to say not financial advice, do your own research here, but uh, I'm telling you, this will be an incredible project, an incredible mint. We have a blueprint, a blueprint. We are innovating. We have the ability to execute on what we're doing. I think you guys will be really, really shocked. So um, we are announcing paper hands, bitch insurance. We are announcing that 48 hours after the mint, if we for some reason have any unsold eggs, we will burn those eggs. So let's say we only mint out 4,500 of the 5,500 within 48 hours after that public mint. The, what did I say, 45 and 50? The last, the last 1,000 will be burned forever. So we will shrink that total supply so that we'll never have more than at that point 10,000 Genesis uh, collection and um, only 4,500 will actually be in existence at that time so that will actually be minted. So that's promise number two. Promise number three is that not only will your egg, once you mint it or hatch it into a bee, have utility inside of Honeyland, you will also have a private uh, access to a gated Discord in our Honeyland Discord. So we are going to be building a Genesis community section that will have a number of channels and a number of benefits that we will announce to you once the mint happens. And so this is where we get to have a little bit of, you know, kind of mystery. Just look at our project, guys. We, we've we delivered at every step of the way. We do things at a extremely high level. And I'm telling you, this will not be any different. We are going to have one of the most special, our goal and our, our vision for this is to build a blue chip Solana NFT project outside of the utility that those bees have inside of the game as a standalone NFT project. We expect to be um, a, a collection that is a PFP, a 10,000 or 11,000 piece PFP collection that will be in the talks with all of the most popular, the Solana monkey business and the Degods and the Degenerate Apes and the um, Famous Fox and the, um, 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 what's the new one, the OK Bears and all of those. We expect to be in the talks with those blue chip NFT Solana projects. We're doing a lot of things on the back end to, to get us there. We have an incredible roadmap. And uh, if you go back to, I had a Founders Journal uh, video the other day where I talk about, you know, one of the things with innovation is that you have to be a little bit more secretive. I promise you, we are committed to three things. 
innovation, execution, and communication. We will communicate with you guys throughout this entire journey, but we have a roadmap of a lot of really, really cool things that we are gonna be doing to add actual value into that Genesis collection and that Genesis community. The only thing that you'll know today is that we are having a uh, risk-free mint, so it's a paper hands bitch insurance for 41 days. You can list your Genesis egg, onto any marketplace, we will sweep the floor every 12 hours, we'll buy back and burn anything that's at 2.5 solar below. We will uh, burn anything that doesn't mint 48 hours after our public sale, if for some reason we can't figure out a way to mint 5,500 of those, uh, we're in trouble. Um, again, we're walking into a weird market, we know there's a lot of things going on, but um, I'm telling you this will be one of the most um, uh, one of the most um, valuable collections uh, on the Solana ecosystem at 2.5 soul, it will absolutely be a steal. Uh, and number three is that you will have access uh, by owning a Genesis collection egg, you will have, or B, you will have access to our, um, to our private token gated, um, which is through the NFT community section of our Discord, which we have a lot of really, really cool plans for. So hopefully you guys are excited about this mint as I am. It's been a long time coming. Mark your calendars right now, May 25th, if you have a pre-sale token, that's a platinum pass or a gold pass, or any sort of, uh, for somehow you have a whitelist A uh, mint token. If you have a whitelist B mint token, or you plan to get in on the public mint, mark your calendars for May 26th. Again, get the exact times in your time zone um, on our uh, website. We'll have a lot of details walking up to this, um, but this is gonna be a really, really special mint. If you don't have a whitelist token yet, um, get in there. We have a whole how to whitelist section. There's a number of things that we're doing. We want to get whitelist into the hands of the people who want to bring, bring the most to our community, um, the people who are um, you know, really excited about everything that we're building, so make sure to get in there. Um, looking forward to this. We will be really communicative uh, leading up to this. Uh, we're gonna be live during the mint. Uh, we will have an announcement just after the mint to kind of talk to you about what you actually now own with the Genesis collection. Um, so stay tuned with all of that stuff and um, looking forward to building our Genesis collection community together. Zub, zub.